hello friends welcome to free cat tutorial and in this tutorial we will convert svg file into the dxf and that dxf we will convert into the 3d solids and how we can import any svg file and convert into the 3d solids for the 3d printings so here i have converted a svg file into the dxf and then that dxf into the 3d solids due to the some graphical issue you may not be able to clearly see it so i will show you in the cad assistance so this is the my svg file and i have uh, converted that svg file into the 3d solids here on my part for the 3d printing so i will explain you how how you can do the same in a free cad so for that you require a ink space software ink space is open source so there is a no any problem you can easily download it and once you downloaded the ink space go to the file and open your file and here i have opened my svg file now all you have to do is go to the file and click on save as and here under the options you will get the two options to save your file into the dxf here is a autocad dxf r12 and 14 so i will go with r14 and i will click on save and say okay and pop up also say okay now on my path here you can see that dxf has been made here so i will open with a cad applications to cross check it so you can see that our svg converted into the dxf now we will click create a new file and go to the open and we will open our dxf file okay so here the uh, free cat split up our uh, dxf file on in this entity there are the n number of uh, sorry there are too much number of entities are there there are two num 206 entities but you do not have to worry about that we can convert into the 3d solid with a small trick so click click on the shape here okay so here i have a uh, selected all this now here on the draft workbench you will see the project geometry or draft to sketch and here i will off my grid okay so it is it has been converted into the sketch so i will press the space bar and i will hide it so this is the sketch has been created here but still we cannot convert into the solids so for that we have to we have to shift to the part design workbench and then i will create a body sorry create a part and then create a body and i will select and drop on my body and inside this body here is my sketch now I will select the sketch and give to the pad and pad I will give 0 0.5 because it I want to impose it say ok same way you project into the sketch this geometry and then convert into the solid like this way as I am doing ok this all and then I will switch to the draft workbench project geometry and then I will press the space bar here then I will drop on my body and again I switch to the part design 
and I will say pad 0.5 sorry create a body to drop on my body one better I will delete it and uh, I will on this one okay now somewhere from here to here no from here to here yes and then I will switch to the draft workbench project the sketch and I will hide it and this sketch I will move to the body 001 now I will move to the part design and say pad and here just I want to impose it so I will give 0.5 so this is how I converted this solid and then once you make this then you can use the boolean operation in FreeCAD boolean operation in FreeCAD where you can combine these two bodies the way I have did it I have a first I have a impose my part here and then I combine with my solid body and then I convert it into the STL for the 3D printing so this is how you can convert the SVG file into the DXF and that DXF into the 3D solids. I hope you like this tutorial and if you like my method of teaching then you can support me on coffee.com. Its link is given in the video description and at the same time I would request you to the please like, subscribe and share my video. I will come with more useful tutorial on a free CAD. Thank you for watching and thank you for your valuable time.